To a developing story, the search for the suspect wanted in three separate subway slashings in Manhattan that has now left three women injured. They're looking for the man seen here in this surveillance video. All three women are expected to survive. CBS 2's Alice Gaynor joins us live on the Upper East Side with more. This is scary, Alice. Very. We're at the 86th Street Lexington Avenue subway station. All of these attacks took place yesterday. Police say it's here that two women were attacked, and then a short time later, this suspect allegedly slashed a third woman at another location. Now they're trying to capture him before he can hurt anyone else. This is the man police are looking for. On Sunday at 4.14 p.m., they say a 19-year-old woman was exiting a 4 train at the 86th Street Lexington Avenue subway station. As she walked up the platform stairs, a man approached her from behind and slashed her right leg with some kind of sharp object. Police say the suspect then went up to a 48-year-old woman from behind as she stood on the southbound platform and slashed her right leg. He took off on a southbound 4 train. We spoke with women in the area shortly after the slashings there. That's crazy. That's scary. I literally walk here like every day <laughs> and I take the subway like almost every day. Just being more vigilant. That's all I can do. It's New York, unfortunately. A short time after those two slashings, at 4.32 p.m., police say while on the train, he approached a 28-year-old woman who was sitting and slashed her left leg with a sharp object as they were approaching the Brooklyn Bridge City Hall station. The suspect, they say, exited at that stop and was last seen fleeing through the Chamber Street subway station exit. According to the NYPD, felony assaults in the subway year-to-date are down. 269 in 2022, compared to 248 for 2023. New statistics, new numbers will be out tomorrow. As for the women, these victims, they were taken to local hospitals and all are expected to be okay. If you know anything about this man they're looking for, call police. Live on the Upper East Side, Alice Gaynor, CBS 2 News. Alice, thank you.